Students in the UK School Sustainability Network, UKSSN, applied to come on a trip to COP26 in Glasgow in October 2021. The network is hosted by Global Action Plan, who coordinated this trip, but we were fortunate to partner with People Power and be sponsored by the Royal Society for Chemistry. We were approached by the UK government to help provide a youth voice on panels in the blue and green zones, as the network was valued for the cultural and geographical diversity across the UK. Hello guys, and welcome to Glasgow Centre Station. We're the first team to arrive, the Avon and Somerset team. Yes. Hey. And we're here. We had a group of students working on the project remotely around the UK as well. But here are some of the highlights provided by students and staff in Glasgow. Welcome to the green zone at COP26. We are entering now. So now we are heading down for our meeting with People Power. I think young people don't have as much of an influence as they should because um, obviously I've both said that it's very important that our voices get heard. Hello, I'm Elena. We are in the left bank right now. Uh, we have a special UK School Sustainability um, menu. And we're with a buddy in Thai tea. And over there, we're having a nice meal. We're having a nice meal. We are now back at the Green Zone for day two. We are today on the People Power stand. Commissioned by a, a company in North Wales. This is made from 100% recycled waste plastic, but it's the plastic that no one else really wants to recycle. It's We've got so much plastic, we can actually make our own wood from it. It's stronger and will last longer than the wood itself. So we can let trees do what they should be doing, which is sinking carbon. How's that? Welcome to a day in our life at COP26. So we wake up in the morning, rise and shine, and we got ready for the day ahead. Um, this is us on the shuttle bus to the green zone. Um, this is us at the green zone. We did this funky thing, which used the carbon dioxide we were aspiring to um, stay up. We're at the green zone now. I had loads of cool artwork, which is at the green zone. Um, and this is us at different stands of the green zone we made a climate pledge which we stuck in the middle of the ocean um there were loads of cool exhibitions make taste not waste and on that note lunch which was all biodegradable wrapping and then we prepped for a meeting with the chair of the un youth advisory group 
Miss Reen are saying. On our way to a Harry Styles and Abra inspired climate theatre event. We walked all the way to dinner. Which is at this really funky vegan place. Um, had dinner with Boris. So yeah. And this is just Olivia looking really cute. There we go. committed to go carbon neutral by 2070. 2070. The UK CERN, which is UK Schools Sustainability Network, and how we are working together to just climate change with a focus on nature-based solutions. The UK CERN, hosted by the environmental charity Global Action Plan, brings together regional networks of students to connect and collaborate on issues they all care about. Fully supported by school staff. There are over a dozen networks all over the UK, which from Somerset to London and even Ireland. The UK SSN has allowed many like-minded students from all backgrounds and school types to come together to share ideas and express their opinions, leading to a positive collaborative effort to help our planet. And how does that make you feel, what you see is happening back in the world? I'm going to help with renewable energy, 